This is brought to you by the Healthy Berry, Queen Street in Chatham, and Batter Bus Services, taking you everywhere in southwestern Ontario. Playoff hockey continues in the GOJHL, and the Chatham Maroons took a commanding 3-0 series lead Sunday night, a lopsided evening for the St. Thomas Stars in front of more than 1,100 fans at Chatham's War Memorial Arena. The Maroons, who had fought to a pair of one-goal games to open the Western Conference showdown against St. Thomas, exploded Sunday with a big 7-1 win on home ice. Teddy McGean was named the game's first star. He scored a pair of third-period markers for Chatham to put them firmly in the driver's seat. McGean also added two assists to lead the way. Alec McKenzie had a goal and two helpers for Chatham. Also scoring for the Maroons were Bobby Harrison, Kevin Gersoy, Ethan Sarfati, and Nolan Vandenborn. Brandon D'Agostino added two assists. Wallaceburg's Brady Pataki was in the lineup. He had an assist for St. Thomas's lone goal. Stars roster also included Ridgetown product and brother of Maroons forward Nolan Vandenburn, Jeffrey Vandenburn, who was a regular for the Dresden Junior Kings this season, a little family feud that may resume throughout the remainder of this opening round playoff series. Local product between the pipes, Brendan Johnston made 27 saves for Chatham. Stars netminder Cooper Dot was pulled midway through the third after allowing six goals. Dan Black ate the final 10 minutes, allowing one goal on seven shots. The Maroons can close out the best of seven series Tuesday night in St. Thomas in Game 4. If necessary, Game 5 would return to Chatham on Thursday. The Maroons up 3 to nothing over the St. Thomas Stars in GOJHL playoff hockey action. This is brought to you by the Healthy Berry, Queen Street in Chatham, and Batter Bus Services, taking you everywhere in southwestern Ontario. 99 1 FM, CK.